What's up guys and welcome to Slender Mirror World. This is tonight's random horror game and from the looks of it, this is a brand new Slenderman game that looks very promising. As you guys can tell by the menu and by the screenshots I've seen, it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun and it looks pretty well made and I'm looking forward to this. I mean, I feel like Slenderman doesn't really get the same amount of love that he used to get. So to see a game like this come out that actually looks like it's going to be pretty good, it's it's a good sight to see. So let me know if you guys want to see me play more of this game because this is only a demo by leaving a like on the video down below. Show this video a ton of support and we will play the full release as soon as it's out and and uh, yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and hop in. All right, let's do this. Here we go. Ooh, what the heck is going on? By the way, that menu music sounded very familiar. If you guys know what that's from, let me know in the comment section down below. But I feel like we've played a game with that. Oh, missing child. Oh, okay. Slenderman just walking by like he owns the place. <laughs> just casually walks by. Slender Mirror World. When I first loaded this game up, I was like, what the heck does that say? I had to like decipher it and read it backwards. <laughs> Ooh, who's calling? Slenderman's giving me a little call. Hey, I'm sorry, Kyle. Daddy won't be home so soon. I have another meeting tonight. I bought some bread this morning and left it in the kitchen. Go and grab a bite. I will bring some food once I reach home. Sorry. I miss sneeze. It's allergy season, you know. All right, so uh, a robotic dad left me some bread in the, the thingy. Oh, Mr. White 2668. Can I actually dial that? No, okay, I can't actually dial that. What's this? Human psychology. All right. So I'm guessing this is like the front door? Door is locked. All right. Whoa, this game looks really pretty, though. Look at this. We're in like a fancy looking... Uh, well, not, I don't know. It's like a apartment or a house? I don't know. If it's a house, it must be like a mansion. Oh, dude, you can turn off and on the lights. That's kind of cool. Oh, flashlight. You took the flashlight. One to turn on or off. Okay. There we go. Let's go and activate this. Even though it's completely bright in here, but, you know, we'll use it anyways. Ooh. So this is like a child's bedroom right here. It's probably my bedroom. What do you got for me in here? Okay, another bedroom. Anything in the closets? Ooh, look, a locked, uh... A locked box. Oh, the code. No, I was thinking it might be that code that we saw on the phone, but that code is way longer than three digits. But let's have a look around first. Door is locked. Where did daddy put the keys? Okay, so for some reason, I, my guess is daddy put the keys in this locked box. <laughs> Why did he put them in there? Wait, oh, I thought I saw a code like scribbled into the furniture right there. All right, so ooh, wait, you can open it. Oh, what? You can hide. Huh? Wait a minute. Is Slenderman going to be in here with me? That's a little concerning. I, I didn't think he'd actually be here, but all right. So there's a hiding spot there. We got to keep that in mind. Okay. So I think the code that we need, it's got to be on this phone over here. Whatever this is right here. See, look, 266809, Mr. White. So it could be 260 or 689. Um, there's also a date right there, 6-1-2018. right, let's try out 260 and then we'll come out and try the other one. So 260, wait, what's over here? Wait, there's more to the house. Oh, hold on a minute. I'll try 260 in a second, but there might be... I thought I heard someone else walking. Okay, so here's the fridge. Oh, there we go. The bread. You took the bread. All right, good. So good thing we went over here first. We have even found the... Whoa. The electric power was tripped off. Oh, whoa. Wait a minute, buddy. What are you doing? Okay, I knew that was a cutscene. That's why I got closer. I was like, that's a cutscene, 100%. Okay, it's dark now. Time to use the flashlight. So, what was that? I guess I'm too tired. Yeah, you're so tired that you're seeing giant men. <laughs> giant men in suits. I need to switch the power on in the basement. Okay, so is that where this is, I'm assuming? Yeah, this is where the basement. Okay, let's try out the first code that we have. So, 260. Examine. Um, how do I... Yeah, I want to use the... Okay, there we go. So, 260. How do I... Is this... Wait, what? How do I, like, type it? Huh? How do I type it into the box? What happened? It's, like, frozen. Okay, like, I put it on there, but how do I actually... Did I open it? What is going on? It's, like, broken right now. Hold on, let me try this again. Okay, I think this might have fixed it. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so how do I... I guess that's not the right code, right? Because if it was, it would just... It would just work. <laughs> so, let's go get the other code. Wait, am I... Oh, my God, I'm, I'm naked! Oh, wait, no, I'm not naked. Okay, I do have shorts on. Alright. Never mind. <laughs> I was like, wait, wait a minute. Who just runs around their house completely naked? I mean, I'm sure there's someone out there that does it, but I don't know, man. Six, eight, nine. All right, let's try this out. Six, eight, nine. I'm going to forget it, dude. Six, eight, nine. Six, eight, nine. All right. Here we go. Okay, so get out the cursor. Oh, wait, not yet. 
Okay, get out the cursor. Six, eight, nine. Come on. It didn't work. But then again, I don't know what the like the enter key is for this. So it it might be the right code. I just don't know how to like actually enter the code into the box. There's no it doesn't tell you. I don't know. Okay, so I've tried everything. Oh, hide. Okay, now. So I've tried those two codes. Neither of them work. So it's either what? I'm stuck. Oh my god. No. I'm stuck in the table, dude. You're kidding. Crawl out. Come on. Don't get who what how does this happen? Ooh. You took the piano chair. Yeah, that's good. But you see, I'm stuck in a, a table right now. How does this happen to me? What the? How did, only me. Only I could get stuck inside of a literal table right now. Imagine you're in your house. You hide under your table for whatever reason. You get out. You just get stuck inside of it. Like, like what? Come on. There's got to be a way out of this. There's no way out. Oh, my God. I've got to restart the whole game. Hey, guys. I did a big brain move. I reload. Like, I saved in the table. I reloaded. If for some reason, it did the cutscene again. But look, I'm out. I, things feel a little different, though, for some reason. But look, I got... Okay, my flashlight's almost dead. All right. So, I got a piano chair. There's something I got to do with that, right? I'm assuming. But I just don't know. Look, this flashlight... Wait, is this flashlight even working, dude? Oh, wait, what? You can open these. Oh, my God. Imagine... There's something in there. There's some... Wait a minute, there's something in this top one. What? <laughs> Don't, oh my god, why? 853. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, I couldn't read it before, but okay. 853. Well, what am I doing with a piano chair then? I thought, oh yeah, I'm gonna have to use the piano chair to like get on top of something to like get the code. But no, it's just in there. Okay, let's just go to the code thing. 853, whatever. All right, where is it at? Oh my god, I thought that was something. All right, so I hope I'm not gonna need this flashlight because I have no battery left in it, so. Okay, 8, 5 three is that oh okay yeah you don't have to press anything it just automatically opens okay what do you got for me what's in here just a random key that my dad put in there yep okay we got the old chest and the basement key thank you for that anything else in here i can interact with no all right i hope there's not a jump scare here no it's like we're safe okay so let's go into the basement now i think that's what this is for yeah all right well i mean my flashlight is completely dead so I hope it's not going to be pitch black in here. Oh, let me see something. Let's see if we can, uh, see if we can maybe, you know, turn up the brightness a little bit in this. There's no way to turn up the brightness. <laughs> All right, dude. Great. I'm glad I have no battery. Uh, what's in here? A painting with nothing on it? A piano? Is this just set up for, like, a jump scare? Wait, no, wait. It says something. Oh, plate. Huh? Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even know. Wait, but how am I supposed to use that? Okay, there we go. <laughs> what the heck? I would have never guessed that. <laughs> I would have never have guessed that, dude. Oh, man. All right, let's get out of here. Hey, why? What the heck? Okay. Cool, dude. Cool. Let's continue. I'm not scared. I need to take a rest now. Oh, wow. You're definitely not scared. You're just going to bed right after seeing that. Okay. <laughs> let's go to bed. Oh, man. It is a good thing I randomly stumbled onto that table as I got stuck under it. Okay, what is this? Oh, we're in like the dream world now. It's, it's this dream again. <gasps> is he gonna show up? This is where we saw him in the intro, right? In this weird, strange world. Oh, there he is. Why is he moving like that? Why is he moving like Edward Scissorhands? What the? You okay? Everything seems familiar. You don't you're not gonna acknowledge this giant man with claws just walking around? <laughs> like he's gotta take a poop? <laughs> Why is he walking like that? I don't know if he's friendly or not. He doesn't seem to like be acknowledging me, so I think he might be friendly, but I don't know. Let's just walk beside him, you know? He seems like a nice guy at the moment. The heck is that? The Grim Reaper? What is that? Okay, he is just Walk, he's kind of walking like uh, something from like what's that that Michael Jackson song that everyone knows the where, where they're all zombies. He's kind of like walking like one of those. Like he's about to start busting a move or something. But I, I'm just gonna stay behind him. I don't know if maybe he's leading me somewhere. <laughs> he's like, bro, follow me. Oh, wait a minute, he turned around. <laughs> all right, there he goes. Let's uh, continue on our way. I guess I don't really know. I think I have to just make it to the end of this. Area closed. Do not enter. Well, it's not closed for now. The gate is literally busted wide open. What is it? Oh, what happened? What? What the? What happened? What, was he on my forehead? How did he get up there? Who's? I'm, I'm opening it. Oh, where's? Where's that coming from? Who's knocking on the door? Is Daddy back? Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. 
How do I have like supersonic hearing? I can hear that. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> okay, my guy, calm down. What just happened? <laughs> this game is wild, dude. Oh, thank you. A new battery. New flashlight with new batteries. You took the flashlight. Okay, so what, 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 what am I doing now? Ooh, we're in a much nicer looking house. Did we like go into the future or something? Gotta find a way out. Okay. So this is all locked. Okay, I guess we can only go this way. You gotta make sure you check like the drawers and stuff in this game though. Because this game likes to hide stuff in random areas. Alright. What the heck? Who lit these candles? Slenderman? Did you light these candles? Do you want me to take a bath? Are you trying to tell me something? Do I stink? <laughs> he caught me last time. He's like, bro, this guy smells awful. <laughs> he needs a bath. Okay, what am I doing with this? Am I using this to like get into the tub? I don't know. No. Okay, I don't think I was supposed to get in here. Uh oh. No, no, not like this. Come on, game. Why? <laughs> Please don't tell me I'm stuck in a tub right now. I'm glitched into the tub. Oh, we made it. Oh my gosh. All right, never jump into the tub ever again. Holy moly. What do I need this box for then? Maybe I need to get up here. This is just a recipe for disaster because you can just glitch into so many things. Oh, there we go. Open the window. Ooh. Yeah, we're in a pretty little uh, city. I guess, should I use this? What happens if I just don't use the ladder? I just jump down. Exit ladder. Yeah, sure. Oh, okay. What if I just jump down? Oh, oh my god. You can actually lose health. Okay, I won't do that. I won't do that. I don't know if I need this health for whenever Slenderman smacks me or something. I don't know. I can hear breathing. What's this? Oh, I thought you could pick that up. All right, let's go this way. Now we know. Oh, wow. He just went right through that wall. All right. That was kind of cool. I guess let's follow him. So we did last time and it took us to the objective so let's just follow after him oh my god this place is massive it looks like it's set up for him to like attack me here i don't know let's just go down it oh it is it's a setup dude i knew it i called it i can't run oh my god i knew it dude it's a setup let me in ah is he gone yeah he's gone dude too obvious too obvious developer too obvious what the heck, dude? What is this tiny little table? <laughs> what? That's like the size of my foot. Why is that table so small? Oh, okay. I thought that was him, dude. What is that? A mine on the ceiling? Oh, another battery. Can I open these? No. Oh, wait, wait. It said something. What is it saying? Move the cupboard. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, all right. Just a, a vent. Oh, let's try this door real quick. I want to see if uh, this will open. Oh, it does. Oh, okay. It's like locked off. Hmm. All right, let's go through the, the secret vent that we accidentally found through here. Is he going to be in here, dude? I feel like he is. He, he likes crawling around, so I wouldn't be surprised, you know? Oh, there he is. Okay, he wasn't in here. He was out there. Help me. Oh, he wants help? Okay. Or is this like the room that he trapped somebody in? He took the gear. Oh, where did I need a gear at? Okay, there's nothing else in here. Let's get out. So we got to use this gear on one of the gates, I'm assuming. I just didn't even notice a gate that needed a gear. So, <laughs> it's all news to me. I think it might be this one. If not, we can always go back. Because we didn't go to that right gate. So, that looks like it might need a gear. Oh, here. Okay, what the heck? <laughs> well, this is interesting. Slenderman? Oh, no. This is another setup area, isn't it? I knew it, dude. <laughs> it's too obvious. <laughs> I'm able to call. That's the second time I've called. Is he? I don't know. if Is he asleep? I'm just going to go through here. Oh, I think I have to go that way. But maybe I need to, like, distract him or something. I don't know. None of these open. I'm so tiny, dude. I need to be taller so I can, like, see up. Oh, I got it. You took the Adam's cage key? Huh? Adam's cage. Okay, I can just grab it from here. What's Adam's cage? Oh, what the heck? Okay, what? He's stepping on me. Stop stepping on me. Get off me. I I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I don't know. Oh, he, he did 10 damage to me, so he's not, a, he's not a very strong guy, but what's that? He's still, oh my God, he's still chasing me. I got another gate key. I don't know. I, where am I going? I have no idea what's happening. There's a locker. Another key. You took Sarah's cage key. What? I'm finding cage keys, but I haven't found a cage, so I don't know what's happening. Okay, I think I lost him. Let's hop out of the locker. 
Oh, I just noticed there's these drawings on the wall. Wait, I just got two batteries and I'm already out of battery. What? All right, dude, whatever. Let's look around for, uh, there, there's cages somewhere around here. It must have been what we passed on the way here, right? Where, is he around here, dude? I don't know. What a weird building we're in. Nothing here, though. All right, let's get out. Uh, let's just go back to where we were. Can only assume that that's where these cages are, because unless this is a cage. No, I think that's a hiding spot. All right, let's go. It's weird. Sometimes you just can't run. Do I have a stamina bar somewhere? No. It's not that I can see. That, the left bar is for the battery, I'm pretty sure, so I don't know. All right, so the cage has to be back out here somewhere. Open up. Open sesame. All right, there's a thing over there. I think I see someone sitting down right there. That might be what we're going to. So we got Adam and Sarah. I don't know who either of them are, but I guess they'll be explained later. I don't know. Yeah, look, look, there's a lock on this. All right, nice, dude. Let's go. Hey, we're in. Oh, all right. Calm down. <laughs> what was that? That was random. That one wasn't even scary. It was just random. He really loves to crawl around, man. I never realized how much Slenderman likes to crawl. What's this? Indian restaurant? Okay. Hmm. Can't even go inside and get some delicious Indian food. What? Ooh, thought I heard someone. Can I go in here? I wish I could see, but you know, my flashlight died <laughs> somehow. I had like 80 batteries in that thing and it still managed to die. I don't know. Well, we can't go in there. That's for sure. That is one shop you don't want to go inside of. All right. Never go in there. I don't even know why those would still exist in today's world, but I get, well, actually, I don't know where this game takes place. Oh no. Is this another setup, dude? No, no, it's not. It's not. But I think up here might be another one right here. Oh, the cages. We found them. <gasps> what are you doing? Open. Oh my God. Get away. What the heck, dude? That's way scarier than Slenderman. Why am I releasing these things? Oh my God. I don't have the key. Thank goodness. Okay. Look, lady. That is so scary. She just casually walks away. She doesn't say anything. She doesn't say thank you, nothing. She just walks away. That is straight out of a horror movie. Why am I doing this? Where does she go? They just walk. Where are they going? Let's see. Are they just going to walk right through this wall? Please don't. Don't do it. They're, they just walk right through the wall. <laughs> what the heck? That is so scary. I don't want to get the other key, dude. I don't want to. Imagine you have to let these things out. That is so scary. Oh my god, I have to find the last key, but it's so dark that I don't know if I'll be able to find it. There's nothing here. Maybe it's back here? Was there another area that I missed? There has to be. Or there has to be like a key somewhere that I missed. Unless it's in this area, but I won't be able to tell. It's so dark. Oh my god, guys, I found the key. I got it. Okay, so also I figured out how to get the flashlight to work again. You could, There's a menu. Look, you press... Wait, what did I press? You press tab and then look. You can use the battery. Well, I thought it would just automatically use it, but it doesn't. <laughs> so now I have batteries. Think I have a, a, an insane amount of batteries, by the way. I think I have enough batteries to last me the next 10 years at this point, because I've got six more of them, which is pretty crazy. And I, I'm only assuming we're pretty close to being this demo, because we're about to rescue the last child, and then we're done here. Like, I don't understand this, though. Like, oh, there it goes. Okay. Sometimes it seems like your stamina is like you have a ton of it, and sometimes you have like none. By the way, this this bar is a lie, okay? Bar, we are open 24-7. Oh yeah? Let me in. That's what I thought. Let this let this six-year-old child into your bar. <laughs> You're supposed to be open 24-7, dude. Liars. I just saw that on the way over to the key and I was like, alright, bro. They're really lying to everyone. Alright, here we go. So this is the last gate. Let's go ahead and open it up. Uh, which one was it? This one. There you go. Get on out of here, you creepy little demon. Get out! Go! Oh no, dude. She's just standing there. Why is she standing there like that? What do you want from me? What? I'm sorry. Leave me alone. It's so creepy. I'm just going to walk away. I don't know. I hope the game isn't bugged or something. Wait, this door. Is this door always here? Oh, huh? Part one end. Game made by them. Thank you for playing. Okay. Well, press escape to show the cursor. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of there. Well, guys, that was Slender Mirror World. Overall, an interesting game, but it's definitely got uh, a wide variety of problems. Um, I think what's weird about it is Slenderman, it like, he smacks you. He, he doesn't jump scare you. 
<laughs> so like it, you just have to get smacked by him like 10 times which is kind of insanely hard to do and he's not really scary because he'll just smack you and then it'll start running into a wall or something so yeah i feel like they need to add like a slenderman jump scare and just make it a little bit more difficult to where like if he catches you you're just dead or i don't know he, he you know like maybe like a security breach where oh wait no well it's something where like they'll jump scare you and then put you down again you know or like he'll jump scare you then throw you to the side and then you have to keep running but if he jump scares you twice then you're dead you know something like that the current health system just feels like it's so out of place and just doesn't work very well um and some of the other things this game it's, it's definitely it's got its problems but i'm looking forward to the full release if you guys want to see me check it out let me know leave a like on the video down below hit that subscribe button if you're new and i will see you guys in the next one thank you guys so much for watching peace out